Hey you right guys, Trace Munch is Joe here and today we are watching and reacting to Five Nights at Freddy's, the horror film that just got released on Peacock four days ago so I'm a little bit, tiny bit late to it and I was meant to film Carrie, the original Carrie today for Halloween but I figured Five Nights at Freddy's, I'm going to get spoiled on it at some point because everyone's talking about it on Twitter and I did want to do a reaction video to it at some point, I was going to do it in November or something uh, but I didn't know it got released the same day on Peacock as it did in the cinema so I figured we might as well just do this and I can do Carrie at the weekend or next week. I played the first one, the very first one when it first came out. Uh, we did a video on it actually, I don't know if it's still up on YouTube, but we did a video on it whenever that was released. I want to say like 2014 maybe, I could be wrong about that, but let me check. You guys all know this because it's us. 2014, I am correct good good yeah we did do a video on it um and it just blew the video didn't blow up the video the video didn't do very well <laughs> because everyone was doing five nights at freddy's at that time and the channel was still new of course but um yeah i, I remember how huge and popular it was it's kind of like you had slender man and then there's five nights at freddy's which are the two like horror games that just went viral for everyone and i can't think of many other viral horror games since it's just like there's so many so much crap out there with, with horror games trying to replicate what Five Nights at Freddy's and Slenderman kind of did. But uh, yeah, we're going to do the film. As for what I know about this, it's got Josh Hutchkison in, which you guys all love from The Hunger Games. I get it. I, my boy from Bridge to Terabithia is what I'm going to reference him from, is in the film, which is going to be good to see him in that. Obviously, we reacted to all the Hunger Games films as well, so it's good to see him in those. And then Matthew Lillard's back, which I haven't seen him in a film since Scream. I mean, it might be the only film I've seen him in. Oh, Scooby-Doo, obviously, Scooby-Doo. Uh, but yes, I think I've not seen him in anything recently, so it'd be kind of cool to see him. Five Nights at Freddy's, guys. If you enjoy, make sure to leave a like, as it does help the video and it does help the channel. If you do want to help vote on whatever film you want me to react to and uh, leave film suggestions, you only have to be a $1 patron over on Patreon. If you don't like the video, don't even worry about it. If you're just stopping by for a good old time, see what the film's about, then you go for it. I'm not going to judge you. I don't really care. Uh, anyway, let's go. Peacock. Peacock's pointed out some good stuff recently, to be fair. I'll give it that. When if it first, when Peacock was first a thing, it was like the joke of the streaming service world. It still kind of is, but this year and a bit of last year, they've done they've done pretty well. Go on, mate. You got this. <laughs> or is it already too late? So don't linger around, bro. Get in the vents. I have to tell you guys, I played the first game and that is it, like I said in the intro. So if there's Easter eggs, all that stuff, you guys will know it. I won't. <laughs> <gasps> oh. They might be all having a party, actually. <laughs> These little screams are great. Oh, mate, it's done. It's done. That's it. Game over. Your security and you didn't know there was a locked door here. Do they do this in the game? That looks comfortable actually, to be fair. Go on mate, you're good at unscrewing this stuff. What? I wanted to see it. Did he get out? I guess we'll find out later. Oh, Blumhouse are very strict with reactions, by the way, like with M3 gun. So, I'm going to show as much as we can. We're going to show as much as we can, but this intro goes hard. <laughs> Jason Blum must be, like, so rich. <laughs> Here he is, my boy. If you want an actual horror traumatising film, do watch British Terabithia, by the way. You will be traumatised for the rest of your life, but... It's worth it. You need a shirt. You know I have somewhere I have to be. Come on, let's go. Five minutes, I need you dressed. Where that is, I'm assuming, playing a dad now. Fudge, but I want the fudge on the side because I don't want it to melt the ice cream. And you I tell him. Cream on top and three cherries. Coming right up. Sure, sure. That kid's going to disappear, isn't it, when he turns back around? We got oh, this new yet. flavor. Rainbow explosion. I oh. bet she'll go crazy. Oh, he works here at the security at this mall. <laughs> She's wearing a security top. Hey! Damn! <laughs> Fair enough. <gasps> Matthew! I'll be right back. You beat up a man in broad daylight. In 
front of his child. No, it was actually his kid then. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out who you are, Mr. Michael. Sh Michael Schmeichel? You're Michael Schmeichel's son. I'm going to be brutally honest with you here, Mike. Given your track record, your options are going to be extremely limited. There is this one place, though, that no one really wants to work at. Thank you. I have a job for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you get to be your own boss, sort of. And you only have to worry about one thing. What's that? Keeping people out. Oh, okay. And, and you know, and keep the place tidy. That's two things. He's got you with that one. <laughs> How's the pay? Not great. But the hours are worse. He's really selling it. Wait. Uh, in case you change your mind. In case you have a change of heart. Yeah, which you will. And I wonder how, because he can't abandon his kid every night. I wish someone would have me a ring. You have a ring. You have like four. What do we got? Okay. It's not the creepiest picture. I thought it was gonna be Freddy Fazbear with a knife, but we'll get to that. I'm sure. Come in. Come on, please come. No, come, come in. No. Come in. Come. You broke my crayon, and now he's going to break you. Something like that. Oh hell yeah! He's got that ASMR to fall asleep to. I need noise to fall asleep as well. I just have a fan on. It's good enough for me. Go watch your brother, okay? Okay. I don't know what happened, man. I'm assuming that's him as a kid. Gonna fall into like some old Vietnam, Vietnam trap or something in Nebraska. <laughs> oh, he took the car. Oh, so someone else. Okay. I thought Garrett was driving. <laughs> oh, never mind. He got kidnapped. Yeah, I thought, keep an eye on your brother. Oh, no, Garrett's driving the car again. After what he did to that poor man. Oh, just... no. <laughs> really? You're crying? Okay. I have really tried to play nice. I have. <laughs> that fake ass cry. In your heart, you know that this is the right thing to oh, do. Oh, for God's sake. I hope that you will sign. My lawyer and I will have to take you to court. Dog court. Any judge with an ounce of sanity will see to it that you never see your sister again. Is that what you want? Oh, his sister. Okay. Did you find a job yet? Okay. That would be a good place to start. At least she's on his side. I don't think I can take the job, though. You're going to have to pay a babysitter, so all your wages are going to go to a babysitter. <laughs> Unless she does it for free, then I mean, fair play. How soon could I start? Okay, I guess we figured out the babysitting problem. <laughs> the only reason they haven't given it the old wrecking ball treatment is the owner is a bit of a... Well, he's kind of a sentimental guy, I guess. <laughs> I love Matthew. His line delivery, though, is so fun. <laughs> Bring himself to let it go yet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love him. There they are, the whole gang. Just keep your eyes on the monitors and and keep people out. Does he know? It's a cake. Yeah, I feel like he kind of knows something a little bit. Maybe he is the owner. I'm going with that. He actually owns the building. And he's the guy who kidnapped his brother or something. <laughs> We're going to link in somehow. There it is, all the CCTV. Now, this is, should be the whole film now. Just sat here doing this. Based on some tweets, this is actually what people wanted. What's this? It's like, okay, right. Is that... Go make a fan-made film, then your budget would be like £100. You get it done. If you're watching this video, it means you've been selected as Freddy's newest security guard. Congratulations. Oh, yeah. Congrats, so Josh. Much fun together. Let's introduce you to the stars of the show. Oh. Sorry, I'm sorry, don't go. Oh. <laughs> They were pretty cute. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> really, that scared you. I mean, it made me jump, Josh, but... <laughs> to be fair, it's quite an intense toy. Yeah, you don't want that staring at you. They've got the sets down pretty well so far, to be fair. Like the security room and stuff. <laughs> 
rat. Hello? Are we going with rat, raccoon, squirrel, rhino, or a giraffe? One of the five. Take your pick quick. I oh, know it's just actually is. One of the animatronics, okay. <laughs> this fell asleep on the job already. Go watch your brother, okay? That sizzle, that little froth, so that was satisfying. Keeps reliving the nightmare. Did you see who took my brother? Nope. Wait! No! I think so. <sighs> he survived night one. Four nights to go. It's that red light in the TV. Yeah, you get out of here. Hey, by the way, I, I do intend on, on paying you eventually. It's okay, okay. she's doing it free. They actually cleared that I one up. where you live. She's helping out the kindness of a heart. Hey, this is the map pat the scene. Yep, yeah, there he is. <laughs> I knew this is the scene that was on Twitter. We are not eating. <laughs> well, that's no fun. You do realize it's that lunch is the most important meal of the day. I'm kind of, it's kind of cool the got him in this, actually. People say that, but, you know, it's just a theory. Are you being <laughs> by the word or could be the I can't believe they had him do that. That's so good. People saying he needs to be in, like, every Five Nights at Freddy's sequel they put in now. Which he does. I agree with that. I don't really watch it that much, but he's, you know, a lot of people know about Five Nights at Freddy's because of him. Had a deal. Yeah. That you were going to find me hard proof of criminal endangerment. Sleeping? Is not a crime. But he's shitting himself. Is that guy okay? <laughs> I just realized I shouldn't be hearing any of this. Who has a brilliant idea, which I realize is highly unlikely. Why don't we just kill him? Right. Mike was saying that he really needs this new job. He's a traitor. Like... His job is to make sure nobody gets in. So, we get in. Your nephew gets canned. Judge gives you the kid, and you give us... Two thousand dollars. One thousand. Mm. But do it fast and don't mess it up. Right, she just halved your deal. A whole grand. Ooh, tempting. God. Night two's got to be where things start to change a little bit. I mean, they're open, which they weren't before. That's about it. Oh no, got some shadows. <laughs> All about functioning. Wait, please, please don't, don't, don't run. God, he has his nightmare every time he falls asleep. One of those kids' faces just disappeared. Did I imagine that? I don't know. <laughs> hey, it happens. Maybe that's no way of being like in dreams, you could never really fully make out someone's face. It's me. <laughs> it begins. Oh yeah, back from you. Certain thing maybe you fell asleep on the job. No, 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 no. That would never happen. You seem to really know your way around the place. Well, Freddy's is on my beat. I like to stay well informed. Also, I really loved this place as a kid. Hmm. I don't trust anyone at the moment. <laughs> they all seem suspicious. Pleasure to meet you, Mike. The, it's me's gone off the mirror then. You've been acting suspicious since the moment you opened the door. Hey, it's just an introvert. Yeah, look, it's been a weird night. And the curtains are closed again. Sounds like Freddy's. I like the little changes like that. Oh, yeah, your security hires? You never last. Because they die. If it's, wouldn't they have gone missing as well? This is somewhere you see yourself 10, 20 years from now. Add to that the thing with those kids going missing. <laughs> Just slid that into the conversation. Here to have your mind blown. <laughs> she moved on so quickly. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> These are all going to be chasing you later. Want to dance? She asked Mike, who she's just met, if she wants to dance to that. She cannot be trusted. Maybe some other time. Uh... There. Now you're official. Night two survived. He's doing well. Who's that then watching? Oh, over here. That little side plot. I think I see a way in. I think I see a way in. God, the whole squad's here. Maximum damage, minimum time. 
You're all gonna die. You see anything valuable, grab it. We'll uh, settle up after. Let's go, boys! Come on! <laughs> I love a little shudder. Oh no, why did, why did they find these actors? <laughs> what the hell's going on over here, bro? Is that what? <laughs> uh, brilliant. Mind you. Oh, oh, it's the little cupcake. I don't actually know who this cupcake character is, by the way. Is it in the first game? I really don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> it begins. Jesus, gobbling him up. <laughs> That's, very cool. That's a fair response. What the hell are you doing? He's just goofing around, don't worry about him. As he locked himself in a Jeff. Okay. It's done, bro. It's done. Yeah. Come on, he's stupid. Yeah. Hank! <laughs> Come on. It's time. Come on. <laughs> they, they actually made them animatronics, I think. Correct if I'm wrong. Which, thank God, imagine if they're all like CGI. I'm sure there might be CGI elements to it, but if they're all CGI, oh God. No, there's no CGI there, I don't think. That's cool. <laughs> you stepped into our home, and now there's no escaping. Where's Freddy at? Oh, the cupcake's on the loose. I'm sure the cupcake has a name. Don't even try it with me. <laughs> when you know you're about to die. Oh, hell yeah. That's cool. Is it Roxy? Roxy. Let me search these names up because I know everyone's going to get really, really angry. Follow me. Don't do that. Hey! Who's Electro Tabab? Who's that? Freddy. I don't know any of these. Chica. Foxy, not Roxy. There's, I didn't realise there were that many characters. Oh my god. <laughs> so many Five Nights at Freddy's characters. Hand comes out of the mouth. Don't do it, man. <laughs> Jesus. That was in the trailer. Not the... Her being eaten in half, though. Well, who's going to babysit now? <laughs> Made a mess. Sorry. Oh. Just, Maybe shouldn't have left that in the drawer. Right? They, don't, they don't mean anything. He didn't tell me he had a sister, either. Are you here to arrest Mike? Okay. Uh, <laughs> Maybe. Your room so me and can talk? It's nice to meet you. Somebody broke into Freddy's. What? What, what happened? Recognize these? It's not what you think. Okay, those are they're sleeping pills. They help me sleep i know what they are mike it's written on the bottle fair enough she's she's a good detective you're not gonna mention all the bodies that were around there's like three corp four corpses four corpses there's this theory that uh we can't forget things every single thing that you see your entire life down to the tiniest of details gets stored inside of you you just have to know how to look that sounds intense that sounds like too much you think you saw who took him i know i did and I know that he's in here, but he's just, he's, it's buried. Matthew Lillard, Lillard. And that's usually the part where people tell me I'm crazy. Really? They call you crazy for that? To the same dream, same place, night after night. It's not easy, so the, the pills help. Some other things like familiar sights, familiar sounds. Oh, okay, that's why he had the post above his bed then. To force himself to go back to the dream. You and Abby, you still have each other. From where I said, I'd say you're lucky. Interrupted by the static radio. Thanks. No more sleeping on the job. When you're at Freddy's, you stay alert. <laughs> throwing pills into the water stream, but... <laughs> Leave a message. She's going with him. I will work, yep. and you will sleep, and under no circumstances are you going to come out of my office. She's going to go missing. 
Do the bodies just disappear then? Because no one's reported bodies. I left a bit of blood. <laughs> Twice. Is that thing from the games? I don't know. I feel like that's got to be like from the games in some way. You're not going to try and terrorise him when his sister's with him, are you? That's just a bit mean. I oh, know they are going to do that. Okay, that's fine. Don't be doing that. She's going to go missing. I know you're back there. Might as well come out. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello. I'm Freddy. Help me remember the man who took my brother. If we show you, what will you give us? It's not him delving into other people's memories, though. If he's trying to ask the kids what they remember about it, I don't know. I don't know if that works. But... Um... Are they eating her alive? Bobby. Jesus, the whole arm is here. <laughs> Stop tickling me. <laughs> tickling you. Freddy, this is my brother, Mike. <laughs> Who screams like that when they're getting tickled? What the hell? Yo, they can all be best of mates, to be fair. This doesn't have to be like an issue. They killed everyone who was gonna Mike, screw you over anyway, so Bonnie. Bonnie. Foxy, Foxy. And Chica. Bonnie was the one I didn't know. Okay. This is Mike. Hell yeah, look at this lot. Oh, they don't seem too bad to be fair. Misunderstood. Hey, Mike. They just want to play. <laughs> they wouldn't stop tickling me. Their hands are like this big. How do they even do that? There you go. But you made Bonnie's day with that. The end. <laughs> Uh. Bye. I don't know, they're not so bad. Three nights down. Is this where the creepy drawing's gonna come into it? That was a dream. So those, uh, those machines... My friends? Your friends. Are they... Ghosts? Hmm. Yeah. Of course. How else could they make the robot to move? Come on, Josh. Don't be a silly Billy. Maybe one of them's your brother. But I really need you to help me understand, please. That's when Garrett got taken. You were even born for that, son. Abby, that boy ever tell you anything about the man driving that car? Anything at all? What if it was Matt Pat? All they talk about is a yellow rabbit. But... I can ask. Yeah, that'd be great. That'd, that'd be helpful, actually. I would really appreciate that. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> like, why is she just hanging out here? You guys trust this character? I'd, um, use the yellow rabbit as well. She knows something. Hey, Abby, if I asked you to wait in the car, would you? No. <laughs> Fair enough. Abby, wait. Nope. Guys, I'm back. Abby, you knew about this. God, how is that like a kid's animatronics? You know how sharp his teeth are. So they haven't attacked Vanessa as well when she was here by herself, so. <laughs> Got the whole team here, let's go. Strange song choice, but whatever. What is happening? Why? I know it's just stopped being a horror now. <laughs> I mean, arguably it wasn't really before anyway, but <laughs> now it definitely isn't. Oh. Damn. Are you okay? What's going on? What is happening? Look What's at them all. <laughs> they were just hanging out with ghost animatronics and not even bothered. It's like, yeah, just normal, normal stuff. It's just so not even phased at all. I can't explain it, but when I'm here, I feel closer to Garrett. My dreams are more vivid and it's like I can almost... Change what happened? Maybe you can. Did you ask them about this? Yeah, I tried. I don't think they like me very much. They were literally lying with you on the floor holding hands. They do like Abby. Mike, you need to drop this. Well, drop <laughs> his missing brother. Right. Why would you say that? Right, I would dance him <laughs> with her. 
Blumhouse make some strange films where they never quite get the tone right. I don't think it's even necessarily a bad thing. It's just because, like, M. Thregan, for example. Wait, Abby, don't! What, is that bad? Oh. Yeah, I'd argue that was a pretty bad thing. <coughs> yeah, it was totally awesome. I don't know what to say. Just go home, Mike. B go home. Take care of yourself. By himself. So okay. Leave Abby with me, would I? You can do whatever you want with your own life, but if you ever bring Abby back here again, I will shoot you. Bloody hell, she's having the time of her life, everyone loves her, it's fine. The pup, like, they're all, the puppet, the animatronic, they're just chilling. So that's night four done, we have one more night. Hey, it's Mike. I need your help. That's called the aunt. Is that bacon? Hey, why don't you, uh, get dressed and then come to the kitchen, okay? I want to talk to you about something. Mm. Okay. You're going with Aunt Carol or whatever her name is. I promise you this is not what you think it is. I hate you. Mike. I'd be sat down for the bacon personally, but... Well, I, I think that went well. Yeah, okay. Oh! This, this now means the animatronics are gonna not like him as well. They're gonna be angry at him. You know what works for me? A warm glass of milk with chamomile and honey. I tell you... Alright, bro! What an ass. <laughs> Yeah, fair enough. He's ready to enter the dream state. Oh, they were quick. They're just stand there, dig in. What the dad kidnapped him? Sweetheart, what's wrong? Don't know why that would be a thing, but... You want to save Garrett, that's why you're really here. This kid here is a better actor than that other guy that was in it earlier. <laughs> you know who I mean. He's gone. They're all gone. Really? Yeah, their faces are definitely disappearing. I'm not imagining that. Okay, cool. We want Abby. They love her, Mike, and she loves them. <laughs> If these ghost children are the ones that are possessing the animatronics though, why are there five? Is one the cupcake thing? It's time to let her go, sweetheart. Yeah, that ain't gonna happen though, is it? <laughs> Did they put those tears on him? They didn't look natural at all. <laughs> you can't have her. Jump scare. Oh no. Right, now that now they've had enough of him. <laughs> Oh, no. What reason? Oh, I get him good. <laughs> oh, so this guy didn't escape, but he kind of got it loose a little bit for him. What? <laughs> there they all are. Okay, this is where all the parties ended up then. Tilly dum. <laughs> I hope she dies next. I don't know how, I don't know why she'd end up at the Freddy Fazbear's, but fingers crossed. Maybe Abby will kill her. Oh no, they are actually just chilling at the home. They've waltzed on down the street. Okay, I'm wrong then. I didn't know they could do that. They're all waiting for you. They're slithering. It's time to go play. Oh, what happened? How did she die? She fell asleep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try to see it with her head off. How do we get there? They're not gonna have Freddy Fazbear getting into a taxi, surely. Where to, little lady? Oh my god, the... what is going oh my on? Goodness. This feels so goofy for what? They just haven't got the tone of this right at all. Well, from what I remember about the game, anyway, it's like kind of creepy and eerie, and then this is just. This is a comedy. <laughs> like I say, maybe the games are like this tone. I'm not gonna pretend that I know. You guys will know better than I will. Max, her brother. Oof. You know about them too, right? Yeah, she she knows basically everything, which we we know. It's complicated. They want to make her like them. Oh yeah, look at that shot. That that cinematography goes hard. <laughs> the man who took them, he was uh Oh, they're in the drawings. I don't know. Very cruel man. Called Matthew Lillard. It's not just their ghosts that are inside of those machines. What their actual bodies are in there? It's their bodies. Oh. Kids, they don't want to hurt anyone. It's it's him. He influences them somehow. He's an influencer. Who? Person. Say it. I know I'm right. I tried Say to warn anyway. you. I really did try in my own way. Because you only got the character in the sh in the film at this point. He'll be coming. Yes. You need to tell me who 
He is. Say it. Say his name. His name is William Afton. Was that his name? I don't know. <laughs> he's my father. Oh, he's your dad. Okay, that's... Never mind, it's not like, I really thought they were going to show a picture of Matthew. It's actually just another animatronic. But her dad kidnapped his brother. Breaking it down again. I can't. If he's there, I... We can let your dad down. I won't be any use to you, believe me. He really messed you up, didn't he? Well, he's an animatronic, so yeah, that would... <laughs> I'll vent on the east side of the building. That's the best way inside. Nice. Getting the ins and outs. <laughs> Have they designed a whole new animatronic just for Abby then? <laughs> Body's breaking it down, man. <laughs> this film's hilarious, what the hell? Oh, she's going in that one, the one they saw already. Maybe. Oh, water, and then the taser? Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, they're easy to deal with. Freddy Fazbear's death scene. I don't like this. Yeah, that's a pretty creepy one, to be honest. Leave her alone! What's that taser gonna do? Yo, the taser wrecks them! <laughs> Probably the most OP weapon in gaming history. I've been an idiot. About so many now things. is not the time. I've been stuck trying to fix the past, but you oh my God. are the most important thing in the world to me, and I promise you I'm gonna do better. Say this outside. Love you too, Mike. Just, just... But we should probably go now. Yeah, with <laughs> I mean, let's talk about this later. Bro, hide! My Pomeranians do that all the time, just deal with it. <laughs> they really don't. They've never done that. But... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> sure. He's just killed off four of them. I know they're not dead. Oh. We're just kind of giving away where you are, no? <laughs> no, if a fox is slow as all hell, just bolt it. Oh, this is the, the bunny. <laughs> the yellow bunny. Just run and drop kick it. You're good at rugby tackles. We've seen that. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. You think that's gonna work on me? Yeah, I literally actually just laughed at you. Oh, it's okay. The last game for us. No. First I killed your brother. Now I killed you. Same guy. Well, symmetry, my friend. I don't know about symmetry, but. Getting kicked about by Mr. Banana. Sister. She will love it. That has to be Matthew Lillard. I don't know. I still believe in my theory. Farewell, my Gushman. That's enough! Leave him alone, Dad. We're all for temper tantrums, are we, Vanessa? <laughs> I'm not kidding, Dad. <laughs> it's, oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, 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 cool. That's why this one could all talk and stuff. Big plot twist. I love that they kind of have Matthew Lillard being the villain of the film, though. It might not have been the Scream sequel we wanted, but... We both know you're not going to use a gun. Oh, okay. The Yellow Rabbit. He controls them. <laughs> when did we call this? Like, ten minutes into the film? <laughs> Parenting, good parenting. <laughs> He's just ditched everyone. <laughs> what did you do? What have you done? Oh, close, close. Oh, they all turn on him. Oh, she drew that up quick, didn't she? They can see you now. They know what you did. Go on, Foxy. Move! Correct me if I'm wrong, didn't Matthew said he signed on for a trilogy? He'll be in turn three. I made you! <laughs> Biting his nipples. That was confident. <laughs> Staring him down. 
I always come back. Yeah, we're waiting for it in screen. Are we on eight? I mean this in the best, mo most complimentary way ever. But I really have no idea what I've just seen. For the past hour and 40 minutes, I have no idea. <laughs> what this film... <laughs> I look at this. It's, I I do. I mean that in the best way possible. Trust me. Like you told me, like when the, the announcement of Five Nights at Freddy's film, this is not the way I thought they were going to go about it at all. The turn she's taken these past few weeks. Whatever you're doing, keep doing it. But they just get out then, I guess. So. What do you want for dinner? Pizza or spaghetti? Pizza. There you go. Both. <laughs> that might be the correct answer, actually. Spaghetti. With meatballs. That is a good choice. They're both elite, so... So get better. And we'll be here when you wake up. Do you think he'll go on a date with the woman whose dad kidnapped and killed his brother? Guess we'll find out in Five Nights at Freddy's 2, Revenge of the Fazbears. You okay? <laughs> I was just thinking about That was an elite friends. scene as well. Oh, he chose that with a pizza. Looking at it now, I'm like, mm, bad choice. Little tease. Is it confirmed to be a trilogy yet? Or are they waiting to see how this one does? Which is it's already made a ton of the box office in the last like four days. So I think expect another 50 of them. Matthew will be back. He'll be back for number two. Wow. <laughs> wow. I don't know. Oh, wait, wait, we have enough to credits here. We have enough to credits. What was that song? Anyway. Uh-uh. Nope, not today. Sorry. I said read the song. Oh, so dumb. What is, what is this film? Again, I mean it is a compliment. I really do, because I had... I had so much fun with this film, but what? What? <laughs> I did not think this was the tone they were going to go to. It kind of just felt like M. Thregan, like a spin off for that film or something, uh, because that was very comedic and that kind of worked for that film. But this was like doing this. I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I had a lot of fun, though. I don't even really know what to say. Like, I felt like the. The first half was a different turn to the second half. Like, it was kind of building up. You had, like, bits of the CTTV, like, things were changing in certain rooms, and you had, like, them just standing there being kind of creepy, and then um, them killing that group that came to trash the place. Then literally, halfway through, the, like, when Abby came to join him uh, the for that, th I think it was the third night or something, the tone just switched to, like, this comedy where they're all getting on and they're all helping each other out. And then Matthew Lillis, like, in a suit, being the villain. Uh, whatever that was about. Um, again, I don't want to sound like I'm saying that's a bad thing. I just think it's, like, why? <laughs> I just, I've just i never seen, like, such a big tone shift for a film before. And, again, to repeat, like I've said a billion times, I haven't played all the games. I played the first one almost ten years ago. That is it. I've seen a bits of gameplay um, here and there throughout, um, like maybe some of the other games, but so I don't really know what the tone and premise of the, of the games kind of are because I know they've kind of built on them and added more characters as it's kind of gone along. But so it could have nailed it perfectly, and this is exactly what everyone wanted. But I don't know. I just, I uh, very, very strange, very strange film. And again, I'm assuming I'm just checking what this kind of got on um, track because I'm curious. But I'm assuming we're going to get more. I think they said they're going to be doing a trilogy. Yeah, this got 60% on track, which is... The scariest part of this movie was when the woman said, everything's better swimming in ketchup. <laughs> oh, God. I know the law, so I was excited for the movie. I, I, I know the law, so I was excited for the movie. I've been waiting for this movie for a few years now. Sadly enough, it's disappointing. To start with something positive, the animatronics look incredible. They did look really good. I'm glad they chose to do actual animatronics and not CGI for... Obviously, again, there could have been bits of CGI for some of them, but uh, for the most part, definitely animatronics, which is great, and saying they got the, the look spot on. But the script, the dialogue, the acting is just mediocre. The movie isn't scary at all, and it wasn't as dark as I hoped it would be. It could have been way better. Yeah, this definitely could have been... 
way better. And I think if they do follow through with the trilogy, I think I don't think the director did a bad job, but I think it would be cool if they have a different director come in for two and then a different director come in for three. Um just to kind of switch it up a bit and kind of see what their take on it would be. Because I feel like you could do a second one and it doesn't even need to have the same characters really. Like do we need Josh Hutchinson and uh what was her name? Vanessa coming back for the second one. I don't really think so. So I think when they do the second one, have it be like a different cast, maybe keep Matthew Lillard in there. Um and a different director, I think, would be and a different writer, a few different writers, I think would be quite good as well. And then I, I think the trilogy could maybe work out pretty well. But I think if you're going to keep the same director and the same characters, I don't feel like there's enough there to really carry a trilogy through. I mean, if they're going for money, then they've done that because it's making tons. So they've done that goal for sure. But I think if you want to make these actually, like, scary and make them an actual, like, respectable <laughs> horror... I mean, you failed with this one, definitely. This is not... I get pretty jump scared pretty easily, but I don't consider that like horror. It's just jump scares to me. That's not horror. Um, this fa if this was aiming to be a horror, it failed on every aspect. This was not scary, eerie, creepy, terror. It wasn't any of those. I won't use any of those words to describe this film. It was funny. It was very comedic. I might even go as far as say it's the comedy of the year, but that's really about it. Um... I think Josh, Josh Hutchinson's Mike was a pretty good character as well. I think for like a main character for a film like this, uh, he was as interesting as he was going to be. But that's really... Uh, Elizabeth was fine. It's good to see her in something other than you, obviously. So, um, but yeah, the story was fine. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Rating. What do we get this? I'm feeling like maybe a, a 5 out of 10. I wouldn't say... To me, that's like bang shot in the middle. The tone was all over the place, as I've said. Story, whatever. But the animatronics were cool. I think Josh's character was actually decent for a film like this. Matthew Lillard's in it, so that's going to be an absolute win. Um, and I did have fun with it. I can't deny that. I did have fun watching this film. But it wasn't creepy at all. Um, and I'm curious what fans of the game actually think of this film. Are they... I mean, based on these reviews, I'm probably not too happy with it. But I've seen some really positive reviews from fans of the games as well. So we'll see. I'm very curious what you guys think of this one. So do let me know in the comments. But thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And if they do a second one, I will definitely be there. So don't worry about that. But uh, until then, take care. Peace.